Gotta get that chicken before it burns. Oh, for Pete's sake. Really, game? <laughs> Welcome to subsistence, ladies and gentlemen. Now he he wanders off after my meat burnt. Oh. Okay, it's time for us to go to the mainland and keep looting. That's a shame. <laughs> it's a crying shame, man. Welcome back, everybody, to Subsistence. I'm an old guy gaming, and we are starting off the day. Uh, it is the dawn now. We pretty much uh, farmed uh, the trees here on the island, and then I made myself a bow and a couple of arrows and another uh, biofuel, and uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. So the night didn't actually take too terribly long. Uh, so let's get started. We have to get out and about and do a bunch of looting today. We need nails um and cordage but nails mostly so that we can continue building on our structure hopefully by the end of the day today we'll be able to uh at least have a roof uh over our head and, and a wall up and all that sort of thing <clears throat> so i think what i'm going to do is go back again to this side of the lake and uh, let's kind of keep our eyes peeled for any kelp that's in the shallower part i don't want to go down deep because you know we don't have very much air at the moment and, um, you know, start looking for those crates and getting those resources. Okay. I'm not seeing anything popping out at me yet, but it's kind of hard to see under the water. We're not doing too bad at the moment on carbs, but we are very low on protein, which is to be expected. So, yeah, we're, we're in the red on protein, but we're almost completely full on carbs. Okay, there's some carrots. We'll just be eating that stuff straight up for now. Later on, we can, you know, plant, plant that stuff. Uh, I don't think I'm really going to worry too much about chopping a bunch of wood at the moment. We need to focus on, on crates. And, of course, you know, steer, steer clear of predators. Okay, this is a build crate, so we should have... Hopefully some nails in here. Nice, very nice. Okay, one thing I am gonna do is I'm going to make another, um, another uh, a couple arrows. So let's craft some of those first. All right, we've got a bear there, and a bear and a wolf up there. I'm not, hmm, boy, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get around those guys. Let's go all the way up against the fence here. Yeah, that's going to be, hmm, I don't think we can get around these guys. Let's just crouch for a second and see if they will move towards the water so we can... I guess the other thing we could do is go out into the lake and kind of swim around them. There we go. Make a couple more arrows. There's no way I'm going to attack the predators for now. We're not ready for that. Okay, well, yeah, why don't... They're actually moving up towards the fence. So, okay, there's a chicken. Um, okay. Let's stay crouched, because that does help. Okay, so we got ourselves a chicken. Let's not go back quite yet, as much as we do need the protein... Um, I want to stay out and gather a few more things before we go back to the island. And once we get back to the island, you know, then hopefully at that point the trees will be ready for us to harvest. Okay, that bear is still hanging out there, so let's go out into the water. Oh, good. Here's some kelp, too. Let's grab that. We're going to go out into the water and kind of swim around these guys. That's going to be our, our safest bet here. And that kelp's a little bit far and deep. Far out and deep. I don't think I want to go for it right now. So let's go around this way. I'm not seeing anything else nearby at the moment, kelp-wise.
Okay. There's another chicken, but he's pretty darn close to the bear. Um... Yeah, that's too risky. Let's not mess with it. Too risky, man. Okay, let's go peek up around here. I see the bear off that way. Oh, uh, shit, there's a level three wolf up there. Okay, we're not going that way either. <laughs> I miss uh, season one, man, where we could just, if the da damn wolf was in the way, we just shot him. Uh, we got to the point where we could two-shot level three wolves and damn near one-shot a level one wolf. But, but we also had our shotgun, too, so and our pistol, for that matter. I mean, I have a pistol now, but it's not going to do a whole lot. But what I'm basically what I'm saying is we didn't have to worry about them. If they were in our way, we killed them. We ruled the forest, man. But that is not the case now. Not for a while. We'll get back there, though. We will. We will indeed. Okay, there's another chicken there. Good. Okay, so two chickens. Uh, we don't want to wait too long because they will go bad. Just trying to see if there's any more... Any crates that we can loot before we head back. Starts to open up over here, so we have more area that we can loot and whatnot. But we just have to be careful of critters. Basically, when you start out in this game, you're there's two things you're doing. You're you're trying to get food and you're trying to get nails <laughs> that's what you're doing food and nails man that's what it's all about okay we got a grub tree here let's make sure there's nothing right on the other side of this ridge there's a deer but we're not going after that right now okay we look we seem to be okay for the moment there's a wolf way out there um let's get ourselves um some wood and a grub and then we may, maybe we can try our hand at fishing again Okay, so we got the grub. There's a bear down there. We're kind of getting into the... around to where the birch forest is. This is a good place for locked crates. And once we make our BCU, we'll, we'll actually get a locked crate. Uh, I'm sorry, not a lock trade, a, a lock pick for free, which is nice. All right, let's start heading back towards our island and get these chickens cooked up and see if we can uh, possibly catch another big fish. I think, though, between the two chickens and even a little fish, that'll, you know, that'll, oh, shit, look at that bear. Go after that deer. There's a damn th good th <laughs> deer was there because I didn't know the bear was there. Oh, scary. Okay, here. Maybe we can get ourselves a third chicken. Nice. Okay, that's better. That is better. Okay, let's keep our eyes open for this bear up here. I didn't even see that bear there, man. It's a good thing that deer ran that direction or we might have been in trouble. Usually, as long as you're paying attention, um, you know, you can see their health bar before they detect you, but not, you know, but I could have missed the health bar, you know, that's the thing. Okay, he ran off that direction. Yeah, I don't know where he went. Okay, let's swim back out and get these chickens cooking. I probably won't build a bridge to this side, or maybe I will at some point. But, you know, we're going to build it to 
what we'll call the mainland first. But of course, that's not going to happen right away either. First, we got to get an actual base itself built. Building takes a long time in this game because the resources are hard to come by. I never really got to a point where I had what you would call an, an excess or surplus of nails until I was more or less finished building my base in Season 1. And then finally, you know, they started accumulating because I didn't need them as much. All right, our fire went out, but that's all right. We're going to do that. Let's ignite this. And we'll butcher all of these guys and get some chicken going for us. Okay, while that's happening, let's go here. And what do we need? We need a stick and some cordage. Okay, we can do that. Let's make a stick and make some cordage. We're getting our list checked off here. Let's get some carbs going. So we're going to eat that and this. And yeah, we're still not in too bad, bad of shape on the carbs. And then we'll craft some fishing tackle. Yeah, these campfires, man, they run out of fuel so quickly. But we have <clears throat> enough medicinal herbs to make even another biofuel. Plus, we have that one there. So uh, let's craft another stick. And then we're just going to make another fire starter and have it ready. Because I'm not going to be able to stay close enough to this damn campfire to keep it, keep it going all the time. It's just not going to happen. So our strategy instead... Uh, oh, my goodness. What the hell are you doing here? This is a bear-free zone, sir. Oh, man. I didn't know they, they would spawn on the island like this. Ugh. Uh, Dude, not cool. Totally not cool. Uh, oh, shit. No, 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 no. Go the other way. Get out of here. You bastard. Level 3 grizzly. Well, that was some rotten luck. Yeah, go the other way, man. I, I, need, I need to get my chicken before it burns. He heard me. I accidentally s stood up, not meaning to. Gotta get that chicken before it burns. Oh, for Pete's sake. Really, game? <laughs> Welcome to subsistence, ladies and gentlemen. Now he he wanders off after my meat burnt. Oh. Okay, it's time for us to go to the mainland and keep looting. That's a shame. <laughs> it's a crying shame, man. Can you believe that? Here, there's a a seaweed here or a kelp or whatever the hell it's called. Oh, man, that was... Uh, well, you know what? It's going to happen. This is subsistence. That's the way this game goes. Um, so let's quit our belly aching and just keep on keeping on. Ooh, that was close. Wow. Okay. That bear, I'm sure that bear spawned on the island. I don't, I don't think I've, I don't recall ever seeing an animal of their own volition swim through the water. Uh, at least I don't think so. Maybe they do. I don't know. Wow, that, is that some bad luck or what? <laughs> I love this game. Yes, I do. I'll just keep telling myself that. Oh, you know what? Well, there's not much point in fishing right now because our campfire is over there. So let's just save our tackle for later. Okay, we got another bear up that way. But we, we got to hit some loot crates, man. Absolutely got to hit some loot crates. Oh, shit. Okay. So, yeah, let's uh, let's go back down this way. Wow, that sucked. You get you get so I mean you get almost nothing from from burned meat in terms of protein. It's just just a damn shame. That's what it is. It's a damn shame. Okay, we got a crate up here. Let's go see what it's got in it. Maybe we can find a can of sham or something in it. Oh wait, wrong game. <laughs> There's another chicken. Uh, how many arrows do I got? I got two arrows. 
Hmm, should we kill it now? I mean, I'm not planning on going back for a while. Nah, let's wait, because it's just going to otherwise go bad in my inventory. All right, well, we got uh, cotton seeds. Those are really, really valuable. Uh, we're going to try and hang on to those, even though we can't do anything with them for a while. Okay. There's a grub tree uh, right up this direction. We'll hit that. I mean, hopefully that bear will will bugger off by the time we get back to the base this evening. And, you know, if we can come back with several... For Pete's sake, really? Come on, game. Uh, if we can come back, you know, with a, a nice handful of grubs, at least we can fish and, you know, get our protein that way. Well, I guess we're not getting... Here, let's go up this way and see if the bear moves away from the tree. I don't want to spend a ton of time waiting for him, but... Oh, well. Probably a good thing we came up here after all. Look at this. Oh, nice. We're going to eat that right now, because we need to. All right. Well, that took the edge off. Okay, he's moving far enough away to where I think we can hit this tree here. Let's go. Let's skedaddle. We got a wolf up ahead there, so let's avoid him. There's another chicken. What? Where's the sun at? Hmm. It's still a touch early, but let's just do it. Couldn't tell if he was going to keep coming out of the the woods there or not. Um, let's butcher him now, so even if we lose the chicken, at least I get the feather. Or lose the meat, rather. I get the feather. I don't think you get the feathers if it goes bad. I could be wrong about that, though. Maybe you do. Let's not take any chances with it, though. Uh, there's a level one something or other up there. That wolf is moving this way. Uh, okay. Yeah, let's go through here. Uh, there is a pond up here, which was not too far away from our, our Season 1 base. And we could grab some kelp. And there is a chest. It looks like a building chest. Come on, give us nails. There we go. Uh, and uh, a biofuel as well. Okay, now the next structure that we need to make is a wall. So, yeah, okay, we have enough nails to do that. There's a rabbit. We should kill the rabbit. Do I have any arrows left? Because we'll get some cloth, and we're going to need cloth for various things. Oh, we missed him, but the arrow didn't break at least. I, you can tell by the sound that it makes. I gotta get, get used to this crappy bow again because I was so used to. Oh, there's a moose! Look at that guy. Um, I was so used to the recurve bow. All right. That rabbit ran over this way. There he is. Okay, let's just see if we can... All right, good. We got another chance at this. Get a little bit closer. Stay crouched. Got him. All right, cool. So this is going to give us some cloth and meat if we can manage to uh, get back with him. Look at that. Beautiful. Okay, let's go swimming. There's a wolf up there, so we have to be cognizant of it. Uh, but let's see if we can get, grab a few pieces of kelp while we're here. Um, actually, you know what we could do? We 
we have a chance of getting a largemouth bass in this pond. Let's do it. That'll give us four fish fillets and four fish oil. Uh, you can also catch pike, which gives you two fillets and two oil. And catfish in this pond. I don't think you can catch the largemouth bass out in the big lakes. I could be wrong, but I've never caught a largemouth bass in the big lakes. But I've caught all the other fish out there. No, nope, looks like we just got a little perch this time. I think, well, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's just a little perch. Yep, okay. We'll probably just turn that guy into oil. We'll see, though. Because we got a chicken and a rabbit. And, um... We need to get a couple more grubs before we go back to the island, so that way I can fish from the island. Let's grab this. More nails and feathers. Nice. Okay. Let's go out this way. There's a, an ammo crate up ahead. We'll grab that, and we'll keep our eyes peeled for more plant fiber. And we got some arrows, too. Nice. Okay, so let's do this. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, I want to make two plant fibers and four boards. Good. And that'll allow us to make a wall uh, when we get home. Okay, we got a wolf over. What's the, what's the deal with the, all the animals by the grub trees? Come on, game. What the hell, man? Damn it. We needed to go over there. Okay, there's some grub trees up this way. Let's go this way. Stupid wolves, man. Stupid, stupid wolves. Ooh, and there's a stupid bear. And there's a chicken. Uh, okay, that chicken's alive. That's good. We're going to keep him that way until he croaks, because that means he'll stay fresh a little bit longer. Okay. We'll put that stuff to use later. Not going to help us right now, though. That's a pig. We're not messing with him either. Okay, here's a grub tree here. Hopefully there's no predators near it so we can get the stuff from it. Okay, I think we're good. Yeah, so building out on the island... Um... I don't know. For some reason, it just got into my head in Season 1 that that's where I wanted to build in Season 2. So I know it's not a very practical place, but um, we're going to do it anyway. And we're going to build a really nice base and enjoy ourselves here in Season 2. And, you know, most of the, the grinding, the blood, sweat, and tears, all that, you know, I'm going to be doing off camera anyway. So it's not going to have a huge impact on you guys watching the series, but... That's okay. I'm, I'm down with that. Okay, we got two crates and a deer. Nice. And there's a crate up here on this rock. Building crate. Come on, nails. Look at that. We have 22 nails, you guys. Um, do we have enough to make um, a roof? We do. Hot damn. Okay. That means we can move our fire up uh, onto our structure. And we don't have to worry about the rain putting it out. Very good. Okay. Um, Considering it's getting on in the day, I don't think we're going to go any further inland than this. So let's start heading back towards the lake shore. And we'll kind of take a, a look through this end of the birchwood forest for any more crates. And we'll stop back by that other grub tree and give it another shot, too. Because, I mean, we, we have a pretty decent amount of protein 
in our inventory. I, I really sincerely hope that bear's gone by the time we get back. Um, yeah, nothing's gone off yet, but we need to we need to get it back pretty soon, or it's gonna it's gonna go bad. Oh, we're out of stamina. That's not good. We don't want to run out of that stuff. That damn wolf is still over there. Son of a gun. All right, well, it's not absolutely critical that we get another grub right now. It, what's probably more important is that we get the protein back that we do have and get it cooked. So let's uh, let's head that way. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna look one more time to see if that wolf moved far enough away for us to grab the tree. Oh man, my stamina is terrible. Come on, stamina. Come on back. Oh, you know why it's so bad? It's because I'm out of protein. Oh shit, there's a bear there. That's why. Alright, the wolf's right there. Let's just see if we can get this grub and then skidoodle. Skidaddle. Let's move this way. Oh, shit, there's the bear. Okay, let's move this way. Stay crouched. The wolf's on one side, bear's on the other side. It's not a good situation to be in. No sirree, Bob. We should be okay as long as we stay crouched and they don't just start walking directly towards us. Okay, bear turned around that way. Let's go. Grab that. Yeah, that's why it was taking so long for our stamina to regen, because we're protein starved. You know, I think I'm just going to swim out to the island. We could possibly find some more crates if we went around, but, um, you know, we really need to get this protein back before it goes bad. Man, I hope that bear's gone. I, most likely it will be, because I think the critters, you know, will despawn after you, after you get a certain distance away from him. But, I don't know, maybe not. We'll see. No, he's still there. Crap. Really, game? Come on. Son of a bitch. Okay. I don't know what to do about that. I'm pretty sure he's going to be faster than me in the water. I could, you know, I could try and draw him off if I didn't have to swim. Shit, this is not good. This is really, really not good. Hmm. What to do? Don't want to lose this meat. This bear's already caused me to lose three pieces of meat. Okay. Um. Fire starter. We need a fire starter. What we might be able to do is, um... Oh, did I not build the wall? Oh, crap. I thought I built the wall. Oh, no. I didn't. Okay. Um, let's stay crouched. I don't think the bear will detect the fire. Okay, let's get those two pieces on right now. And I guess we can get these on now, too. Or this on. The fish... Well, you know, I actually don't need oil right at the moment. I mean, I do, but I'll probably end up just cooking the fish, too. Okay. Uh, now, what do I need? I need two more boards and two more cordages. For some reason, my brain was thinking I had already... 
had already made that uh, the wall, but apparently not. He seems to be like almost stuck. He's just going back and forth and back and forth in that same location. Okay, finally some protein. Okay, let's get the fish cooked too. That's not going to give us a lot, but it'll it's better. It'll get us a little more is what I'm trying to say. Yeah, I don't know, man. That guy is like, he's, he's just back and forth in that same spot. And he's not doing anything else, which is, I guess, good. <laughs> okay, let's make... Um, where is it? Yeah, let's make the wall. Okay, he actually went a different direction now. Yeah, don't come any further this way, man. Okay, look at our protein, man. That's the best we've been so far on protein. Can't complain. We do have a grub, too, that we can use. What I'm going to do is I'm going to actually put this wall up here. I might move it later, but it kind of blocks our view uh, from the bear. And then let's, um, uh, what is it? What's the keys that we can move? There we go. The number pad keys. Let's put that there. And then I'm just going to, I don't think I can pick up a campfire. So I'll just build a new one and put it under here so it's sheltered. So that way it won't go out when it rains. He's still right there. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay. Um. So guys, I think that's it for this episode. Um. So yeah, I'm gonna build a new campfire here and put it right, right there. And then, you know, wait till morning and then do the same thing. Go out and keep gathering loot. And, you know, I will, uh, I'll do most of that on camera for the first few days, <clears throat> you know, uh, in game days, just because, you know, this is when things are the most precarious for us. But at some point, you know, I'll start doing uh, a lot of the looting off camera too, but I'll keep you with me for the first few days. Uh, and, and, sh and we'll go through everything. So anyway, we're going to wrap up this episode here and I will see you guys in the morning and we will go out and about again. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the episode. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel, leave a comment and share out the video and call that bear up and tell him his mother wants him to come home right now. See ya.